in this video we'll see why we should not change the interface once it is once it is published now what i mean by that is let's say if i have an interface which is actor now this actor interface is in development state it is not yet published so what we can do is in the development stage we can add method declaration here so to declare a methods what we can do is we can simply define we can declare a methods like by default all the methods are uh, public abstract so we don't have to type that what we can do is we can simply say it is void and I need a method here. So this interface is actor, right? So what we'll do is we'll say this interface. So first the interface should say, let's say actor should act. So we have an interface which is act here. So we cannot define, so we can only declare it. So let's create a we give a semicolon here. And let's say we have one more inter one more method here which says our actor should uh speak okay because they want maybe uh maybe a different way of speech so every actor should speak uh, yeah that will go for these two methods so in this actor interface we have two methods one is act and speak okay so if you talk about any industry maybe hollywood or bollywood we need to have this two which is act and speak now what we can do is Let's say I want to be a hero, or we need the object of hero. So obviously, every hero need to implement an interface which is actor, so that a hero should know he need to do at least two things. First, he need to define to these two methods. First method is public void act. Uh, we'll say is out. I can act. Okay, so first is he can act. Second method, he should be able to speak because to to speak or to, to to make a dialogue, we need to speak, right? So we can I can speak. So now we have two methods, these two. But all this actor, all these heroes, they have one more one more method, which is let's say uh, comedy. So all these actors, they also do comedy now. Or all these heroes they do comedy now so we'll say as out uh, I can make people laugh so we are writing these three methods so what we have here is we have this hero interface a hero class which implements an actor interface in which two methods are compulsory because every actor should act and every actor should know how to speak but hero should be able to do comedy also now let's talk about we have one more class which is villain now in this class if I say implements and let's say we are say we are saying okay let's let's implement an actor because all these villains are also actors right now since it's a villain we have to also say public void act so in this will print I can act we need one more method which is public void Let's say this time it is one more method, which is a uh, speak, because villain dialogues are more powerful than heroes dialogues. So we say, I can, I can speak. So now we have these two methods. But let's say villain has one more method, which is, uh, let's say public void, uh, rudeness. So all the heroes, all the villains are rude. So we'll say, um. I'm rude. So now we have these three methods. But let's say in future, Hero says, no, I want every actor. Or there's, there's a system which says every actor should be able to dance. But the problem is, after the definition of these three methods, what we have done is we have added actor, we have added hero, we have added a villain. So once they are published, in case, in future, if you are making some modification, let's say if you are changing this actor interface, if you say public void, and every actor should be able to dance now. Again, it doesn't matter is a hero or villain, he should be able to dance. And obviously, and no, we'll, not, no, we'll not go for dance, we'll go for comedy, we'll say comedy. So every actor should know how to, uh, how to make people laugh. Now hero says, great, I don't have to modify anything is because I'm already uh, implementing a method called this comedy. But what about villain? 
Now, villain class will give you an error. Just imagine after publishing this interface, if you are modifying any public any interface, it's a crime. It's because all the classes which are implementing that interface will give you an error. And that's why you should never, never, never modify your interfaces. But hold on. You should never modify your interfaces in case of Java 1.7. What about Java 1.8? The problem is we are declaring this method and that's why villain says error, right? But what if you can define the method? Right? If you can define the method here, this villain will not be give, will not give you an error. But question arises, can we define a method interface? Uh, yeah, that will answer in the next video. So, but till Java 1.7, we know that we we should not modify your interfaces when they are when they are published.